Did you know that your electricity meter holds hidden secrets? Beyond reading your usage, it has secret codes that can unlock a hidden menu of valuable information such as silencing the noise that comes from it, that is the silencing the alerts. You can check your power usage history. You want to check yesterday's uh, power consumption. You can check it, your monthly consumptions, your last three months uh, consumption. You can verify your meter number. You can revisit your old recharge token codes. Come with me as we explore the fascinating features of your meter. If you will find this helpful, consider subscribing to this channel. And we have the first code which is 800 which checks the total active energy which the, your electronics in your household is using. The second code it is 801 which checks the credit balance or the balance of the tokens in your meter. The next code is 802 which checks the current date in which you are in right now. You can see my date. Uh, now the next, the next code is 802 three which checks the current time in which you are in right now the next code is meter number in which you are, not, you are supposed to pay with is my meter number 1425 and uh, 195 and the next code is 805 which checks the sgc number i'll put this in the description below to know what it is the next code is 806 which checks the operation reason this for technical users 807 checks the meter status 808 checks the current power reading of your meter and 809 checks your tariff status or index and 810 checks your odd overdraft information Eight eleven is a code that helps you to check the emergency credit for me it doesn't work but for you it might work 812 is a code that everyone should know it silences the meter number. For me, I have done that. That is why it is rejected. But it will work. It will definitely work for you. For 813, checks the yesterday's energy consumption. I used 0 0.16 kilowatts per hour yesterday. 814 is a code that checks the monthly total energy. This month, I have used 3.14 kilowatts uh, of energy. 815 checks the last date that you recharged your meter. 816 checks the last time you, you last recharged. 817 checks the last recharge amount. 818 helps you to log off a token this is a bit technical 819 is another code that will surprise you it helps you to count the number of times that electricity has gone off 820 is another code that checks your last month energy usage 821 helps you to check the energy consumption the past second month previously 822 on the other hand checks the third month previously of the total energy consumption in that month 823 is a code that holds the amount of energy that you used in the previous fourth month 824 on the, on the other hand is the code that checks the amount of energy that was used in the previous fifth month. 825 is a code that holds the amount of energy that you used in the previous sixth month. 830 checks the last recharge token 
number code that you used. 831 checks the second last recharge token code. 832 checks the third last recharge token code. 833 checks the fourth last recharge token code. 834 retrieves the fifth recharge token number or code. 835 retrieves the sixth recharge token code. 837 on the other hand checks the 8th recharge token code, the last 8th recharge token code. 838 on the other hand retrieves the last 9th recharge token code. 839 retrieves the 10th recharge token code, the last 10th recharge token code. They go in that order. 865 is the last code that checks if the meter is in normal mode. It should display the name success in your meter. Have you paid for your tokens but the SMS has not arrived? Now, there is a solution for that. Check the next video for full information. Follow us and subscribe for more tips to become efficient in your work.